If you are thinking of importing from China or you are already into importation from China, then this video is meant for you. Hello lovely people, by the end of this video, you will be able to learn how to change the Taobao app into English language. One of the challenges of using this app previously is that the whole app is in Chinese language and so many people living outside China who cannot read and speak Chinese language were facing so many challenges in using this app. The good news is now you can change the whole app into English language just like Alibaba. So previously the challenges was everything was in Chinese language. Even though things are cheaper there, many people didn't love to use these apps because everything is in Chinese language. Stay tuned and by the end of this video, you will learn how to change it into English language. So if you don't have the app, you can check in the link in the description box to get the app. So um, all I have to do is to open the app. So this is the app. This is the home page of the app. If you want to change the language into English language, all you have to do is to go to what the Taobao. So you click on what the Taobao. That is on your down right corner. Then after that, you go to settings. Settings is on your top right corner. So I've clicked on settings. If you go to settings, then you choose location. Location so this is location i click on that right now i uh, my current location is in china mainland so you have to change the location to singapore sing xinjiapore xinjiapore that is singapore in chinese language the, the reason why you can change into english language is because now most of the sellers on taobao can ship the things directly from china to your doorstep Unlike previously where you cannot um, you cannot receive the things outside China. You have to get other shipping logistics to ship it to you. But now there are so many countries where Taobao has, uh, Taobao has introduced where they can ship directly to your doorstep. Canada, Singapore, Japan, Korea, many countries. But for now, for the English medium, you need to just select Singapore. So this is Singapore. You click on Singapore. Then next, you click on Chiren. Yes, confirm. So we have done that. After you have clicked on that, go back and refresh the Taobao app. Refresh the Taobao app. So after refreshing it, go back to or the Taobao again. Then go back to settings. Then you click on that settings. Now. After clicking on the location, now we can see the second one, which is Yuyen. That is language. So you click on language. You can see language. We have English and Chinese. So click on English language. After clicking on English language, you can change the currency as well. You can change the currency to any currency that you are okay with. Most people, it's better to choose RMB because that is what you are used to. So, um, now we'll go to confirm i've confirmed successfully so the whole app is in english language everything the reviews everything product detail everything will change into english language so now oh uh, yeah so i've just realized some of the reviews are still in chinese language yeah some of the reviews are still in chinese language let me check the other do let me check those in so even though when you change the reviews are still in chinese language let me see what is in english so this is the product the description of the product is in english yeah okay here is in i don't know why so here is in chinese language but when you go back you can see it's in english language so apart from the reviews all that stuff everything is in english language the description product detail and everything let me check another product so this one is also in 
English language. So, that is the good news. Now, you don't have to worry if you can't speak Chinese. You don't need extra apps, translators, Google Chrome or whatsoever to translate the app. All you need is to change the location to Singapore, select English language and you are done. It will be very easy to import from Taobao. Guys, so this is the end of the video. I wish you all the best in your importation. If you face any challenge in changing the language, let me know or comment in the comment section and I will guide you. For me, I love Taobao so much because the products on Taobao are more quality than Pinduoduo. In my upcoming videos, I'll be telling you the difference between Taobao and Pinduoduo and which one you should import from. Let me know in the comment section the next video you are expecting from this channel in terms of importing from China. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe, like this video and hit on the notification bell for more videos from this channel. This channel is just here to help you learn how to fish and not how to eat fish. We will teach you how you can import from China at the comfort of your home. All you need is the internet, your mobile phone and this channel to learn everything about importation from China. If you need anything from China, whether scholarship, anything business related, we got you covered. Stay tuned and bye bye.